Okay, okay, okay. Here we go, here we go. Wait, off the eye of Venus. Okay, eye of Venus. Alright, no enemies. Except for that big undead bugger! Uh, hello? So now you've managed to find me. I've waited all too long for your arrival. Come on, stop pretending you planned it that way. <laughs> what do you know of my intentions? Have I not sent you the Seekers to lure you onto my trail? Have I not left the signs of my existence so clearly that you absolutely could not miss me? We're not the possessed of your kind reason enough for you to seek after the secret driving force. As much as you twist and turn, you cannot dispute all of that. Yeah, alright. So you, you just wanted me to be here to, you know, do intellectual battles with me? Because uh, in that case, you, you can have it. Why are you here? On whose behalf are you leading your minions? Yeah, that's a, that's a good question. On whose behalf are you leading your minions to war against humankind? My master is the Lord of Night. You know him. You can hear his call. My armies will rise from the ground in his name and shroud the world in darkness. In us! Never, never shall I bow to your lord. Who are you? <laughs> you still have to ask that? Search within yourself, you fool. You know who I am. I'm that dragon. I bear no name. Just as you bear no name, oh. I am given the divine power from my creator. Just as you bear the power of your god in you, my fate is in the destruction of the world. Just as the preaching of the faith of Enos is your purpose, magician of fire, do you not feel the bond that ties us together? Yes, you know who I am. No, that cannot be. Zardus always said... Zardus is weak and no threat to me. You alone are worthy of facing me. So it is written, the time has come to accept your fate. I somehow like him all of a sudden. <laughs> Why are you here? The divinity bestowed upon me will inspire me to drown the world in a river of violence. Only when the last fortress of the righteous has fallen shall I rest. Okay. Let's go on to the final battle of this game. Enough said. I shall chase you back under the rock from whence you crept, you monster. <laughs> You're not yet ready to defeat me. Only one brief moment, and I shall have reached my goal. Your bones will serve me to let the ill winds of death blow across the world. Mm. Alright, I'll just run away, as I usually do. Ow. And uh, heal up over here and just get some of my minions now. That's much nicer. And let's try it, Moth's destruction. I see right where there are enemies in the back. Let's try something else. I mean, this must be epic, right? So so let's try this. I need to drink. The annoying thing is that you have to stop running uh, in order to drink potions, so the only sensible thing to do is to just run to cover and hope that he doesn't heal up in the meantime. But I didn't get hit so far, so that's good. Not very epic, but I prefer easy fights. Alright. Oh, I actually got hit. Oh. No 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 close one Ah 
Oh, he died. He died. <laughs> I did absolutely nothing. Sorry. Was strange. Where's Z where? Where did Zardus go? That, that is. Can I? Oh, the seeker's still open. Oh, that's silly. All right. Um. Back to the ship. The enemy is beaten. This time, I will not rot beneath the rocks. Time to get back on the ship. So that is the last quest of this game. And uh, do I actually have a speed potion? Because this might otherwise. Get rather boring. Just have an elixir of strength, which I absolutely don't need. Do I have snapper weed? That might actually come in handy right now. Weeds. Snapper weed. I have snapper weed, and I would need uh, what to make a strength uh, a permanent potion. No idea. All right. This lasts only like 15 seconds, so let's use all of them. <laughs> Hey, you! It's all over. Now we can get out of here. Now will you look at this? I've never seen such a construction all my life. How on earth did you manage to get past that thing? I was lucky, I suppose. <laughs> if you say so. What are you going to do now? That's a good question. I think I'll go back to Corinna's first. Hmm. Or maybe I'll simply take over Bromore's business. There's always money in that. Honest money. Go to the captain now, and let's get out of here. Okay, this is just weird that he's standing here right now. I mean, none of them wanted to follow me while I was, uh, you know, fighting through these hordes of enemies. And now all of a sudden they're standing here. Are there more of them? I wonder. This way. Open the door. Get through here. No, seems not. Oh yes, who are you? Milton. Milton. Do you have experience with dragon eggs? No, not really. I have heard that a clever alchemist once managed to brew a powerful potion from it. Yeah. But please don't ask me for the recipe, I have no idea. All right, that's it. The temple is now deprived of its power. How do you always pull it off, hmm? Damned if I know. <laughs> Are we ever going to get any peace? We've certainly deserved it. What will you do now? I'm thinking about founding my own academy and preaching our faith. But it could turn out otherwise. I've never regretted becoming a magician of fire. How do you feel about it? I'm not so sure. <laughs> Dry as always. Hey man, you just saved the world. Isn't that reason to rejoice? It is. Hmm, maybe. Come on, my friend. I think the first thing you need now is 40 winks. You should go straight to the captain and tell him to weigh anchor. 40 winks? Is that... Is that the same? A 
that a proverb? Because I, I never heard of it. Alright, I'll save the snapper weed now, because there will probably be more of my friends around. Is that... Is that Milton? Do I see a little Milton over here? Hello, Milton. How are you doing? We won't be here much longer. It's like my headaches just blew away. How did you do that? I have destroyed the enemy. It must have been something very powerful. So what was it exactly? Pink An us. undead dragon. Your former friends from the swamp camp gave me a pretty hard time. Yes. Faith can move mountains. That's how it's always been. Unfortunately, they serve the wrong god. I'll need some time before I can really get over all this. Hopefully nothing like that will ever happen again. There isn't as much swamp weed in the world as I'd like to smoke right now. <laughs> oh, Lester. You cool. Right, and there is anger, I suppose. You use this in the you pulled through. Can we finally get out of here? Yep, the enemy has been defeated. Then let's not waste any more time. Go to the captain and tell him to weigh anchor. I hope there aren't any more of you renegade sect members. Anything is possible. The Seekers were very thorough, though. Even I almost became enslaved by them. Who knows? What will you do next? Maybe I'll retire to the country and become a farmer. I'm tired of fighting. So, oh yes, I remember. We found out earlier that the Seekers are former member of uh, former members of the um, the Swamp Camp, right? In Gothic One, I completely forgot about that. But now I remember. Yeah, interesting. Interesting indeed. Can't, We're in us. I, can't, I still can't believe that that it's all over. But backtracking is, is never really a good uh, way to, to end the game. Backtracking in general is not a good thing. In games. Hey! But we can be on our way now. The enemy's dead. Very good. Then tell the captain to weigh anchor. May our paths cross again someday after this adventure. But um, you know, meeting all your friends here and summarizing everything—that's actually. A nice thought. Even though it just reminds me of of the fact that they did absolutely nothing. That I I brought them with me on the ship, and they were just doing nothing. But then again, it's it's a video game, and and you're the hero, so that's what you might expect, right? Whew. All right, and over there, the ship is whatever her name was. And there seem to be no other members, even though I didn't find Bennett so far. There's Gorn over there. I did find Bennett and Vatras, I think. And Gerion. You stayed with the ship? Sure I did. Just imagine what we'd do if it weren't there anymore. There's nothing left here for us. Tell the captain to clear the ship. And Diego's already here. So I actually wanted to talk to Gary on now. We can cast off now. It's about time. I thought for sure I would rot here on this rock. Now surrender the ship to me immediately. We're not in Corinus yet. And to be honest, I'm not terribly keen on going back to Corinus. I've been there long enough. I thought as much, but this is neither the time nor the place to straighten this out. We shall discuss this again at sea. So what? I'm glad to have you back on board in one piece nevertheless. Aww. Even if you are a rascal, in the end you acted with righteousness. All right. Now go to the captain and let him navigate us out of here. Yeah, he's all right. He's all right. Oh, where's the captain? He's sleeping. Yeah. It 
let's start out, so it's night time. Let's go search for him. He's not in the captain's quarters, at least I hope so, because we could get in there. There's Vatras. Vatras, what, what do you think about my grand victory? I did it. I know. I can feel it. You have dealt a blow to Beliar, which will keep him busy for some time. But bear in mind that this was only an episode in the eternal battle between good and evil. Evil always finds a way to enter this world. The war will never end. Only Adana stands between the warring gods in order to preserve the balance. Oh, come on. He should have helped me instead. But he did. Of that, you can be certain. Yeah. Tell the captain that he should weigh anchor as soon as possible. Yeah, alright, I'm just interrupting him here because that is absolutely unnecessary. I did all the work and he is just standing here being like, But my god, did help you wink, wink. No, he didn't. You were just standing here. No, you were actually sleeping. Sleeping while I saved the world. Alright, captain. Wait, that's Lee and that's bed, bed, dude. Did you hear it? Did you hear? Ooh, I've got a dragon egg here, in case you're interested. I've got a dragon egg here. Well? Well, I thought... I know what you're thinking. Forget it. Keep the thing. I don't want it. I have no idea what he was thinking, but yeah, I got some experience, so that's good. We've done all we needed to do. I'm glad to hear that. I've just had about enough of this old smithy. I need to plant my feet on solid ground once more. Alright, Jorgen. This is it. Jorgen. The enemy is dead. That's good news. Is that all we needed to do on this island? And the human slew the beast, and it entered into Belyar's realm. Zardas! What exactly happened in the Temple of Irdarath? With the help of Inos, you have defeated the Avatar of Evil. And I have taken its power unto myself. Since I left the Circle of Fire, this alone has been my goal. What was denied to me in the Temple of the Sleeper has now finally come to pass. Belyar has chosen me. Cast off. So, you obey the God of Darkness now? No, I do not obey Belyar any more than you obey Enos. Not even the gods know what fate has in store for us. And I am only just beginning to grasp what options are open to me. But one thing is certain. We shall meet.